This is the WMEA audition material for clarinet, track one, the chromatic scale. I'm Shannon Scott, the clarinet professor at Washington State University. The chromatic scale always goes a lot cleaner and a lot faster if you know your chromatic fingerings. So I'm going to go through these one by one. Your low E, you'll play with both pinkies down. You will lift the left hand pinky and leave the right hand pinky down for the F and then swing over to the F sharp on the left hand side. Lift both, G sharp, A, B flat. Now, to get to the B natural without doing a flip, you take your fourth finger and press the sliver key. Both fingers up, you're on C, C sharp, D. Now, for a really fast chromatic scale, use your sliver for the D sharp, E, F. Now, to get from F to F sharp cleanly, you keep your thumb down on the F and use the two lower side keys, not just the first. The two lower side keys will give you F sharp. Open for G, G sharp, A, B flat. And then we start repeating those fingerings even though the notes have different names. B with both pinkies, lift the left pinky for C, swing over the left pinky for C sharp. D, D sharp, E, F, and there is that fork again. Instead of flipping to F sharp, you will use the sliver key or the fork key to play F sharp. Both fingers up, G, G sharp, a, sliver on the A sharp, B, C. Now we get into the altissimo register, so the fingerings are not going to repeat, unfortunately. C sharp is played, two, three, one, two. Thumb register, no pinky. Go to your D, you add the pinky. The E flat is played from the D by adding the sliver key or the fork key. Both fingers up, E, F, you add the pinky on the upper joint. Now F sharp here, this note can be very flat. Don't try to squeeze to make it higher. Use more air. More air will bring it better in tune. At this point, I suggest you take a breath because you're gonna to wanna to slur the whole rest of the passage down. This is the high G I used in our example. So starting here, G, G flat, F, E, E flat, D, D flat with no pinky on the bottom, C, B, B flat, A, A flat, G, G flat, F, E, E flat, D, D flat, C, B, B flat, A, A flat, G, G flat. Now that is a finger we learned on the way up, which is their thumb plus two side keys. F, E, E flat, D, D flat, C. Here is your C flat, which is the same as B natural. So that is your first finger plus your sliver or your fork. So that's B natural, B flat, A, A flat, G, G flat, F, and back to E. So once we are below the altissimo register on the descent, the fingerings are the same. They're labeled differently because on the way up, we call notes by their sharp name, and on the way down, we call notes by their flat name.